Tallest female tennis players of all time. Do tall tennis players have a competitive advantage? That's a tough question to answer. Taller players have more powerful serves and ground strokes in general. But shorter players are more agile and can cover more ground in less time. According to the official WTA list of player heights, the majority of players on tour are over 5 feet and under 6 feet tall. Eva Herdinova, who stands at 1.91 meters, is the tallest female player on record, 6 feet 3 in. To that end, here are the 6 tallest female tennis players of all time. 6. Venus Williams, 1.85 meters, 6 feet 1 in. For more than two decades, Venus Williams and her younger sister Serena have been the mainstays of American tennis. Venus, who rose to prominence as a precocious teenager in the 1990s, is still competing on the tour today, even at 40. She can give much younger players a run for their money. Venus has used her height to her advantage over the years, and her first serve was once ranked among the best in the world. Not to be outdone by her younger sister Serena, Venus has seven Grand Slam titles to her name and is the sport's most successful Olympian with four golds and one silver across all categories. 5. Karolina Pliskova, 1.86 meters, 6 feet 1 in. Karolina Pliskova, a former world number one, has been one of the top performers in the world over the last six years. The Czech has used her height to develop one of the best serves on tour, topping the WTA's chart four years in a row. Despite her high levels of consistency, the current world number three has squandered many Grand Slam opportunities. Pliskova, a top-ranked WTA player who has yet to win a major singles title, will be hoping to make a breakthrough before the end of her career. 4. Maria Sharapova, 1.88 meters, 6 feet 2 in. Maria Sharapova is without a doubt one of the most beautiful tennis players of all time. Sharapova has been widely credited with increasing the popularity of the women's game over the last decade and a half. Maria Sharapova, Russia's tennis torchbearer for years, rose to stardom in 2004 at the age of 17 when she won her first Grand Slam title at Wimbledon. Sharapova, a perennial favorite of photographers, is one of only six tennis players to have completed a career Grand Slam. Sharapova's towering stature didn't always help her serve, she was notorious for coughing up untimely double faults, but it did help her hit flat hand. Powerful ground strokes when she was in trouble. In 2016, she tested positive for the illegal drug meldonium, leaving a serious stain on her legacy and injuries forced her to retire earlier than she would have liked in early 2020. Sharapova, on the other hand, remains one of the most successful female tennis players of all time. And she has already made a successful career transition to entrepreneurship. 4. Helena Sukova, 1.88 meters, 6 feet 2 in. Helena Sukova is regarded as one of the best players to have emerged from the former Czechoslovakia. The 55-year-old comes from a tennis family, her mother was a Wimbledon finalist. And her father was the long-term president of the Czechoslovakia Tennis Federation. Sukova, who stands 6 foot 2, was a top-ranked player in both singles and doubles in the mid-80s and early 90s. Her trophy collection includes 14 Grand Slam titles, 9 in doubles and 5 in mixed doubles. Sukova. A solid singles player, was a four-time Grand Slam runner-up, and reached a career-high singles ranking of number four. Sukova is also remembered for ending compatriot Martina Navratilova's 74-match unbeaten streak in the semi-finals of the 1984 Australian Open. This denied Martina Navratilova a chance at the coveted calendar slam. 4. Aaron Routliff, 1.88 meters, 6 feet 2 in. Aaron Routliff, 25, of New Zealand, is the list's youngest player. Routliff first represented Canada before moving on to represent her birth country, New Zealand. In fact, she didn't turn pro until she was 22. Due to academic obligations, she has won ITF singles title and 13 ITF doubles titles to her name. 
3. Lindsay Davenport, 1.89 meters, 6 feet 2 and a half in. Despite the Williams sisters dominating the last few years of the previous millennium, fellow American Lindsay Davenport held her own and achieved remarkable success. She could match anyone for power off the ground. And her height contributed to her becoming one of the world's best servers. Davenport held the world number one ranking four times. Which is a joint all-time record. In addition to the Olympic gold medal and three Grand Slam doubles titles. She won three Grand Slam singles titles. Davenport's final round match against Venus Williams in the 2005 Wimbledon Championships will be remembered as one of the greatest women's tennis matches of all time. Davenport lost to Venus in a Wimbledon record two-hour, 45-minute marathon despite having championship points. 3. Naomi Brody, 1.89 meters, 6 feet 2 12 in. Naomi Brody. A British athlete who stands 6 feet, 2 inches, is ranked third on this list. In March 2016, the 30-year-old set a career-high singles ranking of 76. Brody has won WTA doubles title, 9 ITF women's circuit singles titles, and 19 doubles titles. Liam Brody, her younger brother, is also a professional tennis player. 2. Akhil Amanmurdova, 1.9 meters, 6 feet 3 in. Uzbekistan's 35-year-old player Akhil Amanmurdova is ranked second. Amanmurdova, who is currently ranked outside the top 400, has two WTA doubles titles as well as nine ITF singles titles. In 2008, she achieved a career-high singles ranking of world number 50. 1. Eva Herdinova, 1.91 meters, 6 feet 3 in. The tallest player on the WTA tour is the Czech Republic's Eva Herdinova. She is another player who prefers to play doubles rather than singles. In 2008, Herdinova achieved a career-high doubles ranking of 55 and won three singles titles and 19 doubles titles on the ITF circuit.